Well, good morning everyone. It's just gone half past four on Friday the 16th of June, the Feast of the Sacred Heart. So um, today, begin the last leg of the journey, all being well to Leeds. And I think it's about 22 and a half miles from here. So uh, the picture behind me, um, I'm in the Airbnb, you know, it's five minutes walk down to the canal. Uh, the picture behind me is one of those from the beautiful story of the boy the mole, the fox and the horse. And in this picture, the, the boy sat on the horse and says, we have a long way to go, he says with a sigh. And the horse says, yes, but see how far we've come. And um, that's pretty much both of those feelings in my mind today. So how am I going to cope with that today? Well, it's the Feast of the Sacred Heart. So I'm going to remain very much focused on Christ and mindful of um, St John Bosco when he did the tightrope walking said life is like a tightrope and we need to keep one eye on Christ at all times and that's going to be very important today to be in the present moment to remember that all of this is about the greater glory of God and for the good of others and there's a prayer for all of you so I'm going to just keep repeating the prayer sacred heart of Jesus I place all my trust in you again and again and again when I'm running. Place it all into God's hands and um, well I'll be in touch with you at some stage later whatever's happened. So uh, I need to get my runner's prayer out now so I can say it with you. Uh, I've been keeping it right there. Um, I can't edit that out so we'll just have to go with it. Run by my side, live in my heartbeat, give strength to my steps as the cold surrounds me, as the wind pushes me I know you surround me. As the sun warms me and the rain cleanses me, I know you are touching me, challenging me, loving me. And so I give you this run. Thank you for matching my stride. Amen.